Well, hello, internets. Top camera, which is this one right here, that's the USB camera. This one right down here, that's this one right here, is the replacement cube, uh, replacement uh, action cam. Only problem is USB output as a webcam is limited to 640 by 480 hence why it looks like utter shit. There's nothing I can do about that really. It's just the way it's designed. There's absolutely nothing I can do. Really. I could potentially add filters to sharpen it. But you know what happens when I do that. It looks a little bit better doesn't it? Less greeny. Well greeny obviously. But the one up top, I have filters. I can uh, make it more sharp. Despite the settings already being sharp. But then again, I've yet to do an evaluation on how good the quality is in general. The one on the bottom, 640 by 480, but it does record in 1920 by 1080. So I need to do a router few tests before I can make use of it. Only problem is it does not support time lapse. And though it's not an SJ cam, it is just a standard HD camera. That's all it is. Yeah. That's what it shows. But output is severely limited and there's really not much I can do about it. But, as it captures, I gotta see. Anyways, that's about all. So I make this video. It's replaced. The other one as long as it's gone because, well, you know, when shit happens, shit happens. It just stops working. This should last longer. The settings are completely alien, but I figured them out. It's weird. The manual didn't say anything about that, but I figured it out. So, yeah. Dual cameras. One, the action cam in the mutilated case with the USB connected. Fixed in. And the other one, just a standard USB camera about the size of a dime. Although, I'm curious if I take the lens off of this one. This is a VGA one. Would it work better? And the fun thing about this uh, camera here, it's not facing straight. It's actually completely to the right. And yet now you're seeing me straight because the lens is crooked on it, the way they put it on. So, I don't know, maybe I should correct that. Anyways, it's a bit of a fuzzle dazzle. It's kind of fucked, but that's just the way they designed it. Anyways, thanks for watching. And this ain't no fucking short either. This is a 4K 1 to 1, not 16 by 9. Even though you do see two 16 by 9 images. Radio! Thanks for watching.